We're getting our first look at the Gophers. Sparkling brand new athletics facilities, Athletes Village. It's the largest private fundraising initiative in the athletic department's history. And now it's ready for athletes to use. David McCoy took his camera for the grand tour. Three new structures essentially constitute the Athletes Village. It took a little over two years to build them. 166 million. As of right now, we're at about 107, 108 million dollars privately raised towards that. No tuition dollars, no taxpayer dollars. None of this comes at the expense of any program or facility on the Greater University of Minnesota campus. We've never had anything like this in the history of the athletic department. A centralized area where all our student athletes can come and eat. We'll head into our lounge here, check out the men's basketball locker room. And the court is actually about two steps outside of your locker room, which is a change for us as well. These facilities, they're extraordinary, but they're not extravagant. They're top of the line in every way, but there's not etched marble. Uh, some, there's not a lazy river, sorry Clemson, you know, there's no miniature golf course. Women's basketball, the same footprint as men's, not bad, right? I'd venture there's very few places in the nation that are as equitable in terms of having a facility for their women's basketball program that's exactly the same as their men's program. We're going to cross the lobby and we're going to be in a gorgeous new academic center as well. The academic center is just dramatic modernization and expansion of what we had before. This is our new football hall of fame. Uh, this, this is an awesome space to celebrate the program's history. This is our new football weight room. Uh, this is 16,000 or so square feet. So we do have a small barber shop here. The guys love it. So this is our locker room, um, shaped like a football, just like the one at TCF. And here, this is a student athlete lounge. This is where our football team can hang out. You got your kitchenette, you got your ping pong, you got a little air hockey, you got some arcade games. My favorite feature, at least, is this giant floor to ceiling window that overlooks the indoor facility. Head across the skyway, we're gonna go down to the field. 400 feet by 200 feet by 85 tall. You could literally take our existing indoor and put it inside of this facility and it would fit. This is something else, isn't it? $166 million facility, more than 338,000 square feet added, about $107 million raised to this point. You can see that that money really is transformational in terms of what it's doing for our programs, that investment from private donors. It's incredible.